channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. First of all, just be logged into your credentials and once you're done with that, just me come back over here, click on the checkbox and then just me click on agree and continue. Now here just me search for the Vertex AI, click over here, wait for a second now. Now just me click on this workbench. And now just me click on this open Jupyter lab. Just me wait this over here. And it's done. Now here you can see this file name called intro Gemini curl. Just me double click over here like this way. Now if you're using a Jupyter notebook for the first time, okay. If you'd ask to choose a kernel, you can just me choose a Python 3. Then just me click on the select over here. Okay. Now if you are using a Jupyter notebook for the first time, so for running a shell or you can say command, you can just me click on this play button or you can just me hit shift and enter. Just make sure that your kernel status must be ideal. If it is busy connecting or disconnecting, that time you have to just me wait. Okay. Now what you do, we have to just me come back over here, click on the task number two, scroll down and from here you can see this project and location. So first of all, just me copy your project ID like this way. Come back, scroll down a little bit and from here you can see project ID. So just me replace over here like this way. Now for the region, just me copy this region carefully and replace over here like this way. Okay, make sure that there is no extra space, otherwise you will face error. Now just me scroll up, click over here like this. Now just me hit shift and enter till end like this way. So just me hit. Okay, so it's done. Now you have to just wait for your kernel status show as ideal. And once it's done, we are done with the lab. So just wait for a couple of minutes. And it's finally done. Now if you just check over here, as you can see, I'm getting this kind of error. And because of this error, I'm not able to get a full score on this lab. Let me just show you that also. So if I just check the score for each and every task, I will get a score without any issue except one task. And you can see I got a score for each and every task except the last task and this thing might happen with you. So if you face this kind of error on any particular task, so what you can do, you can just come back over here and rerun that shell again. So as you can see for the last task, I'm getting this error. So just click over here again and just rerun it again. So just wait now. And this time I got the output over here. Once you get the output over here, now if you just may come back and click on the check my progress, you will get a score without any issue. It might take a couple of seconds to update the score, but don't worry. If you get the output, then you will get a green tick and you will get an updated score also. So just may wait and watch. So as you can see, I got a green tick over here and score also update and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys